In this video, Cresco International demonstrates how clients can use IBM Watson Analytics to analyze social media topics and trends. This helps clients identify the pulse of an audience by enabling intuitive guided data analysis of social channels. Using IBM Watson Analytics for social media, we can type a topic and quickly explore relevant insights and relationships to uncover key patterns and trends. Since the NFL Super Bowl 50 is upon us, we would like to find out social media trends toward the Denver Broncos and Carolina Panthers NFL teams, both teams that are in this year's Super Bowl. Clicking the social media function on the upper panel, we now move to the Watson Analytics for social media. Giving a new name for this social media project, in this case, Super Bowl, we then click Create Project. In the topic page, we can specify the topic and social media we want to analyze. Here we enter Denver Broncos, then click on the Add button next to it. Notice that a new topic called Denver Broncos has been created and shown. Drilling through the topic, we can determine what kind of terms should be included or excluded for the topic, and specify different kinds of terms. In this case, there is no need to specify the topic to be football. The right panel shows the suggestion keywords that are related to the topic. As social media changes every second, you can refresh to see what the latest suggestions are. In the Themes section, you can decide how to break down your topic into attributes. In this case, we just want to focus on its overall behaviors, so we do not break the topics here. Watson Analytics for Social Media allows you to specify the time interval you want to focus on. Here, we focus on the recent time of one month to get the latest social media trends. Selecting all four languages provided and choosing the source to be Twitter, we can now start to create the analysis. The results come from seven parts, topics, themes, sentiment, geography, source, active authors, and demographics. In topics, we can clearly see the social media trends of each day, which topic is hotter at a certain day, and in this case, there were more discussions about both teams on Christmas. Also, both teams have almost the same amount of mentions, with Carolina Panthers only slightly higher. We can also zoom in on the line chart to focus on a short period of time. In sentiment results, most of the mentions are neutral for each team. More percentages of positive and ambivalent mentions are found for the Carolina Panthers than the Denver Broncos, but we can see that there is a less percentage of negative mentions toward the Denver Broncos. Fans of the Denver Broncos are more likely to keep their neutral attitude. In addition to sentiment, we can focus on geog geography characteristics of those Twitter mentions. We can also see that among 22,280 total mentions, 9,283 are from the United States, and the rest are from all over the world. Drilling down to lower geography levels, we can see the detailed Twitter mentions of each state or each city. Watson Analytics for Social Media also provides the ability to track the source of all mentions. In the author page, the top 20 authors that generated the most content will be shown in the tree map according to the volume of the content. The deeper color indicates that there are more followers of this author. Some people choose to reveal their gender, marital status, and parental status on the social media website. In the demographics, we can see that the percentage of mentions by demographics. For those who do not show their demographics, Watson Analytics for social media will indicate it as blank. At the same time of generating visualized reports, a data set that supports our findings has also been created. We can perform more filters on this data set, and the above chart will all also change in dynamics. To see how your organization can benefit from IBM Watson Analytics for social media, contact Cresco at info at crescointl.com or call 844-6-CRESCO.